What is going on ARMY? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, in this video, we are going to be taking a look at the comeback trailer and the introduction for The Most Beautiful Moment in Life Part 2, that being Never Mind. Now, I have been exposed to Never Mind um, through Jimin in the tattoo that he has on his rib, and this is supposedly the inspiration for that tattoo that Jimin has. Um, we have watched it on stream, but I'm going to uh, better convey my thoughts now that I have them more um, formed based off this comeback trailer, so let's watch it, and then we'll discuss it. And then um, we will probably do a separate deep dive video into the lyrics discussing what I think is going on with this introduction. So without further ado, never mind. <laughs> The butterfly. <laughs> there are also no subtitles, unfortunately, but that's okay. I'm not going to die. I'm not going to die. Never mind. <laughs> One hell of an intro, to be honest. One hell of an intro. <laughs> okay, let's talk about it. Let's talk about the actual music video. So, when we look at the lyrics more individually, I do know what the lyrics generally say, but we'll take a look at the lyrics more individually in a separate video. But I I, I think it's important that we took at the take a look at the representation of the comeback trailer, right? It's sort of setting up the theme uh, that we can expect going forward, similar to, like, how the School Love Affair uh, comeback trailer with the the gates entering a paradise and then transforming into a hellish nightmare. <laughs> All right. This is not necessarily what, we, what we're what we getting from this video, but, like, it's good to take a interpretation from it. Okay. So I, also, I do like the fact that it's obviously showing... Uh, microphones at the very top, and, it's, and we can hear the crowd, that being ARMY, because at this point, they're definitely having some success, and it's not just, you know, a group of 30, 30 members of ARMY, you know, showing up or whatever. They're actually having a good amount of success. I like hearing the crowd. And then we have the formation of the butterfly. The butterfly... In my opinion, at least here, because I know the butterfly stands for something something in the BU timeline, is, is a little... I don't know if it's different, but it stands for something. <coughs> Alright, so this is primarily Suga's song, right? Primarily. We do get a bit of uh, the other members 
uh, uh, some of the other members a little bit later on. But this is primarily Sugar in the intro. And we know Sugar loves basketball, right? Uh, and here he is shooting hoops, getting in the zone, the most beautiful moment in life, part one. Again, has some influence of it, happiness, uh, stuff like that, right? So he's in the zone here. Also, don't think I don't notice those three stripes. Adidas. This is that moment of we're no longer in the zone. We're now we're reflecting, we're contemplating, we're starting to think. You know, we're not in the zone of basketball. Not necessarily even just basketball. Everyone has their other things that gets them in the zone, in their comfort zone. This is, Sugars is basketball. That's why it's represented here. The butterfly. Butterflies, we know, uh, at, at least in my opinion, well, we know that butterflies are very fragile creatures in real life, right? I think that's sort of what the butterfly is representing, the fragility. Uh, but also, we see him later on. We'll get to it. It's a little much on the eyes that going on right there, but what the butterfly is going down is a tunnel, right? It's very overly stimulating to the eyes, and it feels like you're going through it very, very fast, right? I think this is life. Because you see here, he's in the woods. It's very obviously that he's chasing the butterfly in the woods. But it transitions into the city. This is reality of life hitting you. You're in the woods, you're a kid, you're fooling around or whatever, you're chasing the butterfly, now you're in the big city. The reality of the world is beginning to hit you. Cars are driving by. Uh, you're no longer a kid. You're an adult. Uh, what are you doing? Stuff like that. Now, chains are beginning to form around the mic. Trapping. In entrapment, right? Also, I, I do I do notice the water, so sort of maybe like a drowning feeling. Surrounded by butterflies, though. Now, we'll talk about this more in the deep dive when it comes to family and responsibility and bankruptcy and making money and success and what are you doing, pursuing your dreams. Again, a continuation from the very beginning of No More Dreams. Pursuing them anyway, in spite of. We'll talk about it in the deep dive when we actually look at the dual set lyrics. This is where the passion comes in. I like to think of this section in the music video as it gets more warpy and everything, it's less. The cityscape is gone. It's more so sugar. Well, it's more so this individual. He's no longer chasing the butterfly, reaching out for him like a desperation. It's more like following. There, he's chasing after the butterfly in a more of a following, following manner because it's not desperate. <laughs> You can also hear the song is transitioning less from like, it's it's getting more inspirational. You hear it with the trumpets and everything, and the way he's no longer running, more and more so following the butterfly than chasing it. Never mind. I think the butterfly is the fragility of the dream, and 
what you want so desperately that you're chasing after it and you're desperate for it, like reaching out for it, but rather than, than following it, you know, I, I could be wrong, but that's what I take away from, from nevermind. That's my personal thing. Um, I like it. <laughs> it's, um, I like the transition. It's very inspirational by the end. And there's that moment. We'll, full, we'll go full screen. That moment where he's saying, fuck it. Right. You got to sometimes have that, like, in spite of all odds, I don't give a shit. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> like he says. Um, yeah. Um, I know I know this album is a big, big favorite of a lot of ARMY out there. So I'm looking forward to uh, uh, experiencing it with you guys. Uh, so, uh, stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for the deep dive. Um, pursue your dreams. Follow them. Uh, they're delicate. They're fragile. Um, we, we are, you know, uh, I wouldn't say that we're fragile because people are pretty sturdy. Uh, but we all have those moments of self-doubt, self, self-reflection, what the hell is going on, stuff like that. So, um, to all the youngsters out there without dreams... Find them and follow them. Yeah. A big shout out to my YouTube members. Thank you so much for your generosity and your support. Thank you, Liliana. Thank you, Millie the Bean. And thank you, Kelsey. Thank you so, so much. I really appreciate it.